Okay, we just did a little bit of a little video that showed how to go from base 2 to base 16. And like anything, this is a mathematical concept. And anything in mathematics, I, if I learn something going in one direction, it's always nice to learn it in the other direction. So I might want to go from base 16 right back to base 2. So let's do a really quick example of base 2 to base 16 to make sure we understand it. Um, let's take the number 0, 1, 1. So 1, 0, 1, 1. 0, 1, 1, 0 in base 2. So again, I simply take my red marker and I underline groups of 4 starting on the right hand side and then I just convert those groups of 4 into hexadecimals. So 1, 0, 1, 1 1, 0, 1, 1 is B 0, 1, 1, 0 0, 1, 1, 0 is 6. So that's B6 in base 16. Okay, so to go from base 2 to base 16, I simply group them in chunks of 4. And what that means is each one of these hexadecimal digits represent 4 binary digits. So we could come up with, let's just come up with an imaginary hexadecimal number. A, B, C, 5. Okay, so there's an imaginary hexadecimal number. Let's make sure we indicate that. There we go. So what that means is that each one of these values represents four bits, a nibble. So if I take a look, A is represented as 1010. So 1010 is A. B is represented as 1011. So this is my B. C is 1100. That's my C value. And 5 is 0101, 0101. And that's 5. And that's it. That's all there is to it. And now that's, that is ABC5 and base 16 converted to base 2. You will actually see sometimes when people are writing out base 2 numbers, they'll actually break them up into groups of 4. And this is the reason for that. This trick, a nice extension idea to make sure you understand, this trick applies to any base which is a power of 2. So you could do this using base you could use a similar form of this trick for base 8 you could use a similar form of this trick for base 4 you could use a similar form of this trick for base 32 it applies across the board and it's worth trying it so again if you really understand this what I suggest you do is write a short little program that converts base 2 to base 16 but applies this trick and that's a nice little exercise in substring and breaking up numbers all fun stuff I hope that helps